G'day, I thought um, today I'd just talk about something that I found um, while I was playing around with uh, OpenXR as a um, VR environment for DCS. Uh, I used to use VR Kneeboard, um, I've been using it for quite a while, but it didn't have the ability to work um, with OpenXR. Um, and it led me into a bit of a, a look at how I could fix this and I ended up stumbling across another virtual kneeboard uh, called Open Kneeboard and uh, I really like it so I thought we'd have a look at it. I'm actually in Steam VR at the moment. That's the beauty of this, it can run in either Steam VR or OpenXR so you can switch between the two and um, you can pretty much use it with any program. So I've got it on at the moment and um, I've got it positioned where I sort of like it about the right size. That's all adjustable um, for both environments, Steam VR or OpenXR. Uh, it has a gaze feature where if I look at it it can expand uh, which is pretty handy. Um, you can see at the top it's got VMA214 notepad, so they're the various tabs that it has. So on my um, Wacom pad I can, I've assigned a couple of the buttons on there to um, tab between that. So I'm in the uh, AIP tab, uh, TAC and charts tab, uh, checklist tab, and our FAC keyboard. So if I go back to the notepad there, um, you have the ability to um, page down, so I can go to page two of the notepad. Uh, there we go, there's page two. And back to page one. Uh, obviously you can write on it. Um, and I found the writing on open kneeboard is uh, superior to VR kneeboard in that it's a lot smoother. Um, it also gives you the ability um, just to change the stroke width just by the pressure you're applying. So if I have a look at that, I can do it zoomed in or out, but if I write um, test with not much pressure, now I'll add some pressure. There we go, and that. You can see um, the variable pressure. Um, I find just the smoothness of it compared to Uh, the enabled um, a lot better. Obviously, you can erase by assigning a button on uh, the stylus, and we can erase. Um, Racing is quite smooth. Um, yeah, it's a really nice program. Uh, the guy that's done it has um, done a great job with it. Um, so, if you're looking at a VR kneeboard, uh, have a look at Open Kneeboard. It's also still in development, so where VR kneeboard is not. Uh, definitely worth a look at.